Hi guys, this is Diane here from Design Creative and today I'm going to quickly show you how to customize your menu items in WordPress using Headway. Now, we get this type of query, well I get this type of query a lot and I seem to also find this type of query mentioned a lot in the Headway forums. People are not quite sure how to do certain things when it comes to the menu items. So I'm going to show you the quickest and easiest way, well really the only way, um, to customize your menus. And one of the first things you would need to do is add CSS classes to your menus. Now it's not as scary as what it sounds like. It's very, very easy. All you need to do is head over to Appearance and Menus. And then from Appearance and Menus, you go to Screen. Oops, sorry. Going in the wrong place right now. I think my mouse is a bit sensitive. Screen options. Okay, so we're in appearance and menus and we're going to go to screen options. And here, if it's not already been selected, please press CSS classes here. And what that does is it opens up a little option in the actual menu structure um, section that allows you to add your CSS classes to your menu items. Now, it's very easy. I've just added different ones already just to save time on here and to show you how really easy it is. So for my CSS classes I've called the home page yellow, I've called the about page blue, I've called the work page I think green. So um, these are the colours that I hope to change the background of these menu items into these colours. You can call your CSS classes anything you want but I'm just going to use the words yellow, blue and green so then it's more easier for you to understand. So once you've added all your CSS classes, you want to save your menu as it is. Okay. And the next thing you want to do is you want to go to the front page of your website. Now just ignore this background at the moment because this was done from um, a previous tutorial. So I'm just going to show you um, <clears throat> from the start what you have to do. So if you're using Chrome, which hopefully you are because it's the best browser in the world, um, you need to right click and inspect the element. Okay, you need to right click and inspect the element of your menu. So make sure that you're hovered over your menu item in order for this to work properly, in order for it to bring you to the right location um, that you need to see. So if we have a look down here, here is basically where most of the HTML is and on this side on the right is where all the CSS is. So if we have a look here, it will show you exactly where my class is. It says yellow. So I remember that the home, I classified that CSS class as yellow. But WordPress also adds its own CSS class to the menu item and it calls it menu item 16. OK, so you wouldn't be able to just target yellow in your CSS and say change yellow to whatever it is. You would also need to target the menu item number as well. So with this information here, what you'd want to do is you want to highlight it so it turns blue. And then on the right, you want to click new style rule. And what it will do is it would create a new style based on what is highlighted. And the quickest way to basically get this into headway is to just right click and copy. And once we go into headway, I can paste this in here like that okay so here it starts off with the dot which equals a class and then it says yellow dot menu item dot menu item and then it blah 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 but the most important thing is that we have yellow in the front or our class name in the front with the dot and at the end we should have the menu item and our number at the end of our class okay and now we're going to put our curly brackets in and now we're going to specify what we want changed. So I want the background color to be yellow. And immediately, as you can see, the background color to only home becomes yellow. And I could also do some other things on it, like change the font family to coda, maybe. And that one is the only one that gets changed to coda.
so that's super cool now let's try another one let's try uh, the blue as you can see here we've got blue green pink purple gray these are all of the CSS classes which I created myself okay so once it's highlighted we want to click new style rule and we can even make the new style here so I could say background color blue and it changes into a blue and I can copy and paste all of this copy move that over into headway and paste and now it's changed into blue okay say if for instance we wanted this work button to only have a green background when it's hovered over well that could be easily done again we go over to green menu item we click here to where it says new style rule and we can copy this into headway but before we add our curly brackets we want to add something else and that is to say to uh, the browser that we want this menu item but we want this menu item when it's hovered over so we add a space and we add a colon and we add hover at the end and then we can add our curly braces and then we can add our background to whatever color we want it to be sorry I did that wrong there it should be background color green now if we hover over it it turns into green perfect so that is how you make individual background colors for your menu item I might also do a tutorial a bit later about how to add maybe images to your background colors so if you've got an image that you that you need to use or you may have an icon that you might use for each menu item I'm going to sh give sh maybe show you a t tutorial a bit later about how to do that but for now we're just going to stick with backgrounds keep it simple and I hope this tutorial works for you I hope if it's any problems just leave me a message below subscribe um, or if you've got any ideas of any tutorials that you want me to do let me know and I'll do them for you okay see you on the other side bye